Meditation can really be very easy. It simply means to reach a calm state of awareness with a focus on something, like an object, a thought, or an activity. Doing this slows the usual stream of thoughts that race through our heads. It allows your mind to relax and reach a calmer state of awareness. Your body responds by letting go of tension and stress. Sounds great, doesn't it? Feels great, too. Can be downright euphoric. So what would you use as a focal point? Well, breath is a common one. It can be very effective. Another common one is a mantra, like OM or Goose Fraba. <laughs> some of my favorite focal points are the sights and sounds in nature. And I'll get to some of those. But along with great focal points, some other benefits to meditating in nature include when you're out, you're surrounded by pure soothing energy. Everything works in cycles and tends to stay in balance. Getting out and experiencing this while you're meditating can really rejuvenate your spirit. Another benefit of meditating in nature is that the exercise of getting out there can get your energy flowing. Now what would you meditate on in nature? One great example would be the sound of rain, and I'm experiencing that right now. What else could you use as a focal point? Well, that would depend where you are. Beaches and bays have the warm sun's rays, sand's connection with the earth, and the soothing sound of waves. The waves make a wonderful focal point. So does the beauty of a beautiful sunset. Now, like oceans, deserts are vast and mysterious. They have beautiful rock formations, peaceful starlit skies, and again, a sunrise or a sunset could make a wonderful focal point. Mountains have a special energy of their own. I know as I climb high, I feel like I'm getting closer to heaven. Things you might focus on include a spectacular scene, a wind through the trees, or the sound of a gurgling stream. If you don't live near mountains, you may get out in your own neighborhood, watch clouds as they move across the sky, Focus on birds in your yard, or maybe a sunrise or sunset over a nearby beach. Listen to the gentle waves lapping at the shore, or maybe lapping at your boat. You could sit in your yard and take in the beauty of roses or other flowers. If you'd like future meditations to show up in your feed, please be sure to hit the subscribe and like buttons. All right, so what do you do when you get to your place in nature? Well, find a quiet spot, hopefully without people walking by. Stretch, sit down and relax. And then choose your focal point, such as the sound of the creek or maybe ocean waves. Take a few deep, clearing breaths. And if you're focusing on a sound, maybe close your eyes. Now as you start to focus, your mind may start to wander. Just gently take note of that, bring your focus back. The more you work on meditating, focusing on a focal point, the easier it gets. Learning to let go of stressful thought can really help to keep you relaxed throughout the day. Using a focal point in nature is a very simple form of meditation, like my book, Simple Meditation. Is it the best meditation? Well, I'd say there are benefits to a whole variety of meditations. So please stay tuned on this channel. Thank you.